Hi, this is Shiva Rajaya from VitalCoaching.com. We are talking about female shadows, how to master, how to honor, how to love them. And the topic for this video is how to hold space for a woman's emotions. Women are emotional, right? Not all of them. Some of them have more emotions than others. But we, as men, are really required to be able to navigate a woman's emotions from a place of respect, from a place of beauty. If a woman is sharing something, she's like, I'm really sad right now. I'm having a hard time with something. I feel insecure about something. And um, your natural response is to either block that emotion or not honor that emotion or tell her there is something wrong about that emotion or be in a space where you go like I don't have time for this retreat withdraw block then uh, she's going to feel frustrated because she will feel like she's being robbed from an opportunity to understand something deep about herself. If we take an emotion like sadness, for instance, there is an access to bliss, to a profound blissful experience in the very core of sadness. When a woman is diving into her pain body and she's going like, I feel sad, sad, sadness. Where is that pain coming from? You know, and she's feeling into it and through the process of feeling it, she's sharing it with you, right? She goes like, well, yeah, here's what's happening. You know, I feel sad because of this and she's sharing, right? She's in the process of exploring. The sharing itself is an exploration of what she's feeling. And then, you know, in the process of, of what she's doing there, if you don't know how to listen, if you don't know how to slow down and stay present with her, you are going to block her experience. You are going to rob her from the possibility to go and explore that in a safe and sacred space, in a safe and sacred way. And so, as a man, it's a powerful responsibility and a powerful energetic input that you can have in her life by just being there and being like, wow, I can see something powerful is happening in you right now. Let me listen. How can I support your experience? How can I be here for you? Is there any way I can help you right now? And she might say, just, just give me a hug. Take me in your arms. Listen to what I have to say. In the process of doing that, what you're going to do is like, you are going to honor an aspect of her being that is usually being suppressed. That pain that she's feeling internally, what you will notice is that there is going to be a moment where the pain itself, she goes to the very core of the pain and she reaches that point in the core of that shadow where suddenly grace kicks in. Suddenly she feels like Phew! an energetic release. And the reason why there is an energetic release is because she stopped trying to resist that emotion. And so you as a man, you can do a profound therapeutic work with her by allowing her to access these places of wounding and hurt and pain inside of her by just being present and listening. This is why she might go to a psychotherapist instead, so that she can voice and ex express to somebody who is going to be there, present, and allowing her to navigate these emotions. And so, holding space for a woman's emotions, it's such a powerful way of bonding with her. I encourage you to try it out, to explore, and see how you can stay present without blocking or stopping any of that. Makes sense, right? 
I'll see you soon for another tip.